You know, you can be naughty with a glove puppet. And welcome once bigger. The podcast is all out of ideas. <laughs> I'm Martin. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and at, uh, at, at twenty to ten in the evening, that'll do. That'll uh, do. We, we had lots of fun last week watching Ragtime, and we're still alive. So now we're going to do another horrible puppet show. Um, yep. Do you remember Pitkins? Do you remember? Oh, 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 yeah. Do you remember? <laughs> oh, yeah. Do you remember? <laughs> Stuart McConey is getting in the bunk on just thinking about it. <laughs> um, yes, uh, he remembers everything. If you ask Stuart McConey, does he remember it? And you could like, finish that sentence with any word or phrase or thing, Stuart McConey, for five quid, will remember it. <laughs> but very specifically, needs that five quid first, or at least sight of it. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh yeah. I remember. And then he'll put his hand out for the five pound. <laughs> the five pound will be placed in his palm, like yeah. he would a fortune teller. Yeah, yeah. And he goes, "Yeah, I remember the AIDS crisis." And then he'll talk about that. And you go, "Oh, Stuart, that's not even what we asked you." He said, "That's what I want to remember." <laughs> and weird, unhealthy fixation with it. Stuart, do you remember Pipkins? And he goes, "Oh yeah, oh yeah." And then you put the five pound in his hand, and he goes, "I remember the AIDS crisis." <laughs> No, Stuart. And then you try and take the five pound back from him, but it's gone. It's magically gone. Just disappeared. Didn't even see his hand move, but it's gone. It's it's, it's in his pocket. (laughs) It's absorbed into his skin and ended up in his pocket. He goes, uh, that's beer tokens. That's what he says. (laughs) And he goes by and he goes and buys as many beers as he can with that five pounds. Drinks all but one. Saves that one for Christmas. Thinking ahead. Thinking ahead. Thinking He's a clever man. Yeah. Clever man. He does but. little um hampers <laughs> for his family. You know, put one one little bottle of beer in each one. That's lovely, isn't it? That's very thoughtful. What a thoughtful man, Stuart McCone is. Yeah. But his hampers full of like sawdust <laughs> and dead insects. <laughs> and memories. Um, yeah, because he won't remember what Christmas is unless you give him a fiver. <laughs> no, exactly. <laughs> Do you remember last Christmas, Stuart? Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, I remember. And you put five pounds in his hand, and he goes, the AIDS crisis. And you go, no, Stuart. <laughs> no, Stuart. Stop remembering the AIDS crisis. There are other things to remember, Stuart, but he won't remember them. He'll pretend like he will. <laughs> For a fiver. For a fiver. But just think of what he could, if he just saved up. All that money, mm. all those fivers over the years have like, been given him to remember things. It just seems like a waste, doesn't it? It does, doesn't it? But that's uh, that's how they make TV shows. So, you know, who are yeah. we to argue? What a prick. Um, but but we're not doing. Uh, we're not remembering Stuart McConey. We're, we're remembering, remembering the AIDS crisis. <laughs> <laughs> remembering. <laughs> I'm not sure about that now. <laughs> <laughs> the whole of that conversation. Um, <laughs> We're remembering Pipkins, which I don't actually remember. I don't I remember around what it was on. Give me five pounds. I might remember it. For you. But I, I know what it was because one time I saw Stuart McCony remembering <laughs> it, genuinely remembering it. Um, After we've watched this to refresh our memories, we will remember it for you for five pounds. Hmm. Talk about other things. Yeah, crises of descri- different descriptions. <laughs> um, so we are going to watch uh, Pipkins. Yes. Uploaded this by episode. Uploaded by James Fox. Do you think he was a Pipkin? Was there a Fox Pipkin? There, I don't know. Oh. I think... Uh, I, d- I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want five pounds um, just to see if it jogs yeah, your memory please. a bit? Um, best comment underneath from B. Owie. Uh, you can do all sorts of things with a glove puppet. He means wanking with it, doesn't he? He does. He means. All those exclamation marks can only mean one thing, can't they? Uh Yes, Michael, we have been naughty. Okay, a bit odd. Um, yeah. So Pipkins had like some really shit puppets in it and was about puppets, and there was a man in it. Let's watch Pipkins. Let's do that. Three, two, one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Right, this is apparently an infamous episode. Did you already say that? No, no I didn't say it on <clears throat> here. But well, why is it infamous? Hopefully we're going to find out, but it's uh, probably not looking great. Well, there's like 
maybe there are some euphemisms. Someone says the innuendos are enlightening. So maybe uh, it's maybe. a bit like when uh, Roger and Freddie had their wangs out or twangers, whatever it was. In that unaired <coughs> rainbow thing that, that people say, yeah. oh, do you remember when that, that actually happened? And they know, they don't think it was actually on telly, you idiots. What? Okay, so he's a hare, isn't he? Not a rabbit. He's a hare. He looks like he's got the mange. It's it really does. It's monkey puppets. Awful stinky puppets. They look like they've been found in a charity shop and treated in rather bin poorly. In the charity shop. In the bin in a charity shop. Pipkins, 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 Pipkins. Jesus Christ, it's even more racket. <laughs> it's awful. It's like it's gone through the wash and then gone through like the waste disposal unit and then gone through the wash again. Oh, it, it looks as if it's gone through the wash, but they also were washing their collection of barbed wire at the same time. <laughs> oh, now I've broken my washing machine. Oh, fuck. <laughs> that is awful, that puppet. That pig. What is wrong with his eyes? <laughs> is that Jesus. a stroke? Right, <laughs> talking about it being naughty. Never What's know. been naughty? The pig. Yeah, never know what about the glove papax. <laughs> the YouTube, um, the uh, the captions is working hard and doesn't understand the word puppet and has put papac, p a p a c. Well, of course, papac <sighs> is the uh, is the word, isn't it? I don't know. It might be for this thing because it's not a puppet. Is it a muppet though? No, it's not a muppet. You can you can tell the difference. <laughs> well, I can't. You should. A muppet is a byproduct of a man and a puppet. Oh, ooh. well, that might be a Muppet then. How is this thing getting more raggedy with every <laughs> appearance on the screen? They all hate it. They're all stomping on it in between takes. This thing's had a stroke. Look at this mouth. It's fucking awful. It's horror. Ooh. Oh, no. The worst puppet ever. Mr. Punch. That's a, that's a Prince Charles spitting image puppet. Look at it. Mm. Mm. Do they still do Punch and Judy shows? Because that's a fucking terrible thing in the 21st century, isn't it? It, it is. It There's a, a film coming out, isn't there? Is it? Um, Punch and Judy, but it's, it's uh, like the real people behind the story. So I think I assume it's a made up story, but well, uh, crocodile well, it's, it's a story, isn't it? Policeman. But um, yeah, but it's like the real life Punch and Judy, Mr. and Mrs. Punch. So okay. I don't know. It looks. I'm intrigued by it. Fucking hell! This is like something out of the Conjuring universe. Look, it's gonna <laughs> kill him. What? Yeah, it'd be great if he just screamed. What the fuck are you? <laughs> <clears throat> Chasing me, seeing smacking Amara's cutting at night. <laughs> Hello, Harley. I'm not hardly on you. No, I'm Michael. How do you do, Michael? So she, he doesn't even know him. So this is a stranger puppet. It's a stranger puppet, and it's uh, got a murderous face and intent. It's stolen his pencil. It's going to stab his eyes out. Oh Christ! <laughs> he, did, he just attacked him. <laughs> it's the Evil Dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh Harley. It was you, it was Mike. Oh yes, but he's on your hand is now, I mean, you made him do it. That scene what? in Evil Dead 2 where he has to cut his own hand off would be that much better if it was a glove puppet on there as well. <laughs> <laughs> it would, wouldn't it? But it's a glove puppet of himself. Oh Christ. This Stroke is... Stroke Pig's back on. <laughs> Stroke Pig. Stroke Pig, that's his name. <clears throat> that's what they call me. Well, if you eat a lot of bacon, like a lot of it, you would end up having a stroke. So, <laughs> oh, this thing's horrible, this little thing. I don't <laughs> it is like it. awful. And it looks like, and I can't place what I'm thinking of, but it looks like an actress, an old lady actress. I know what you mean. Yeah. But I it can't does think. also look like every spitting image puppet face oh. as well. <laughs> the eyes are looking in slightly different directions, which isn't great. And it's got a smock on. It's it, this is just fucking nightmarish. Again, is welcome there a, to our nightmares. Is there a third nightmarish puppet show we can do to make this a trilogy after last week? I really should. This pig, how is it eating that egg? Because it's got trotters. It's got no kind of thumbs or fingers to pick up the the toasty soldiers. And it lives in a horrible nightmare of its own making, doesn't it? It's got food in front of it, but it can never eat them. I Imagine have no mouth, but I must world. scream. I don't what want to wake up in that world. <laughs> in that world. This became be? your reality. Would I be a Pipkin or would I be the human man that lives with them? You'd be some sort of horrible aberration of both. I like now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I That's love soldiers. <laughs> that says. <laughs> <laughs> I have lost my cool. I'm mad now. I'm um, weird fucking pig thing. Oh, it's awful. It's because the eyes are so dead as well and it's looking straight oh, at God. us. When it's scrunged, then oh. that's horrible. 
Tortoise. But he's not oh, looks like a dear. tortoise. And the person doing the punch voice has got one of those, what do they call them? Like a wattle or a woozle. Squeakle. Squeakle. A squeakle. A squeakle. Yeah. Ooh, you can see the hand going at the back. There's just absolutely no shits given about this, is there? No, there isn't. <clears throat> um, going back to what you said there about you being a, a human Pipkin. Yeah, yeah. It's, you've heard people call you that, right? Well, I wasn't supposed to hear, but when I you walk down hear. the street, going Pipkin, Pipkin, <laughs> Pipkin, pip pip oh, you're Pipkin, <laughs> Pipkin. Oh, that's what they're saying. Yeah. Who's okay. had you got up your house, Pipkin? <laughs> Have you not heard them say that? Well, He's no. hopping it. <laughs> the hair, <laughs> the hair is is fucking Mr. Punch. <laughs> He's up his willy. <laughs> They're docking, I believe it's called. <laughs> Look at it, really is. <laughs> it's really awesome. staring into each other's eyes. <laughs> I mean, at least there's love in the eyes. <laughs> No, there isn't. That's, <laughs> that is hatred from from two, Mr. Punch, and that is the fight. The, the rabbit, the hare, wants to eat it. Two pairs of dead eyes staring at each other <laughs> while banging. <laughs> oh, I look know. away! Normally, look away when I look away when I climax. Normally, I have to pay or go to specialist websites for that kind of interaction. <laughs> no, <laughs> you could have. <laughs> Nice boys, do there be times when it's more fun to be around to everyone and the oh. only one to change the mood if you... Wow, well, they're really getting into it. They're jiggling. That's why this is infamous. It must be... Oh no, oh, it's dear. worse when they're looking at each other. <laughs> Christ. Where's Holly Where's... in that glue puppet? <laughs> one of my bridge soldiers. Bridge soldiers. <laughs> oh, they're still staring at each other. It looks like it's about to kill oh, the no. other one. Oh, there's a badger. Martin Daniels must be nearby. <laughs> He's going to come in and smash it. And that is... <laughs> just, he runs in and just you just see him like, do a downward punch, punch into the ground. <laughs> you know, like um, in, in Batman v Superman, in the warehouse scene where Batman punches that guy into the floor. Oh, <laughs> I, was, I was thinking more like uh, like Captain Falcon in Super Smash Brothers. He's just going to come in and go, Daniels, punch! And then um, <laughs> a special effect happens. That is actually quite a good badger puppet. The badger's eating it! <laughs> That's what badgers do. But it's there now. What's going on? It's everywhere. I'm so confused. Hello, dear. Oh. I'll read my glove puppet and my name. Come down the big <laughs> just, <laughs> just trying to... Is this no. real? Oh, that thing is screaming. That is a proper creepypasta. Like, it stared into the camera and just opened its mouth. Oh. Where's my soldier? Come on. Where is he? I don't know what you're talking about. Why is he Irish, well, he's Irish now? now? His voice has changed. I don't know what you're talking about. You've eaten they're it, Allegiance. They, they're seriously kicking the shit out of this puppet. They, they fucked it. That didn't help. They're beating it up. That didn't help. <laughs> that was dead look. It's not moving. <laughs> this human man is somehow mixed up in it all. And he's trying to make sense of the world he's awoken in. But oh, the badger's Christ. full now. He's eating his. Yeah, well, there are two of them. Maybe. Have a golden identity. What does the badger sound like? Oh, he's gone. Stop talking then. I wish I didn't hear the pig's voice, but that's happened. Yeah. Why do you find it sexy then? No. No, the opposite of that. This is breach soldiers that time. <laughs> Got me to have a good learning. Super big, possibly. <laughs> Jesus. This guy's in, in a psychiatric wing now. He's got to be he could have, to live, he could have, have living this. <laughs> that, that, the, the caption said, could have been seriously chartered. Could have gone for it's an accountancy. Ah, it was him all along. Oh. It's only a puppet, unless you idiots. <laughs> <laughs> I've just been using this also. Yes, I have. Why can they not see him? Well, they're puppets. They, they instantly fall for the illusion of puppetry, don't they? Oh, I see. Unless he wasn't controlling all the time, now he's just very seriously molested that dog. <laughs> he's now he's just claiming uh, the crime as, as his own. Yeah, he's going to cook the gut puppet away. <laughs> How does that mean? <laughs> this is just this. I don't know if this is worse or not than Ragtime. I think it's pretty horrible. <laughs> I think Ragtime was slightly worse. 
because ragtime at least i I'd, I'd never heard of ragtime so ragtime felt like it was some kind of horrible nightmarish dream where it's oh, Christ is oh no <laughs> i'm changing my mind this is so horrible where was, who even made that puppet it was clearly made by some sort of demonic geppetto <laughs> <laughs> I think what Pipkins is demonstrating is that most puppets are awful um, and Jim Henson was clearly a genius because he's done something yeah. something very clever to not make any scary Muppets. Are these all shit? I am a nice glove puppet and I like to be kind and gentle to people. Ooh. Is this still Irish? Uh, I don't know. When, when, when it was Irish it was the man, wasn't it? Oh, I don't know. You made me do so many naughty things today. Leave it turned up. Michael. Michael. Oh, yeah, because the bloke's name's called Michael. But yeah, but the puppet is just a puppet. Oh, no, Johnny. Who's Michael then? <laughs> Michael's the puppet. Oh, Christ. <laughs> Go back to sleep now. I'm never sleeping again if that thing's in my house. No, I mean, look, it was, was gesturing to throttle Hartley then, so. I thought love I puppets. Puppet. <laughs> <laughs> Other night when glove puppets can move around and talk all by themselves. Jesus. Oh no. I don't even want to think about that. Not a word to anyone. In the house. <laughs> it's our secret. Yes, our secret. No, the typical of the seventies and eighties. Children's TV presenters saying it'll be our secret. <laughs> yeah, right. That's um. That's partly why this is infamous. I'm assuming. I think you can give him back his glove puppet now. Why? Well, I don't. I don't own a glove puppet. Badger. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even real. It was me Ooh. working the love prophet. The glove puppet <laughs> has turned working, into love prophet. Working, working the love prophet is definitely a euphemism I shall be using from now on. <laughs> I think that might be a um, the uh, the album title of a prog rock band. Working the love prophet. <laughs> oh, Shaking no. hands with the governor of love. <laughs> So ah! it. I got that. That was like a horror ending because it's cut to the credits. <laughs> it was. There's going to be a sting after, surely, where we're going to just see the body parts of the man. Yeah. <sighs> Time. <laughs> no, it's still going. <laughs> I thought it was over. Make, make a drum puppet. I want to die. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? <laughs> off, off, bubble hat. Wow, it's really not working. Oh, he's going to make a monster, isn't he? That anyone can. No, that's that's not a puppet. That's just put putting the hat on your hand and pushing it in. That is like some not kind of worm monster. You know when you see like you see in uh, things like June or I don't know where. Yeah. But when it's like a, just a pulsating mouthpiece on the end of a worm. Yeah. And he's putting goggly eyes on now. That's not better. He's got like a hipster beard now. <laughs> <that point. laughs> yes. Oh no! I, that is uh, every puppet in Pipkins is scary. It doesn't matter if you know it's a hat. I know. It was a hat five <laughs> seconds before. Now it's a monstrosity that's coming to kill me. Christ, he's making monsters as well. <laughs> what is it? What is Monster it? These making. People? Oh, the badger. His eyes are all weird. They're looking up all the time. <laughs> he's blind. Jennikin. Blind Mike. badger. Martin Daniels blinded it with a cigarette butt. <laughs> He just kind of went, Ugh. Oh, they're doing the Michael Finnegan song. And then he ran off and said, I'm better than you. And he said it. <laughs> Am I better than them now? Not yet. Not yet. Not that one. <laughs> <laughs> goodbye, goodbye, Jesus goodbye. Oh, Christ, fuck like... off! <laughs> Jesus Christ. I was leaning right in. <laughs> so was I. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, God, I could be dreaming about all this shit tonight. It's I don't know. awful, though. Oh, it's got, oh, it keeps looking at me, Mark. Why is it looking at me? It's looking at me, too. We're both going to be killed in our dreams. Oh, boy, Mr. Punch, or Mrs. Punch, or whatever the fuck that was called. Michael. Puppets made by Jane Tyson. Fuck She's you. She's a bitch. Whatever this puppet's made of, it's got some sort of... um Curse? Curse, definitely. <laughs> but also... um Haunting. Uh, Haunting, yeah. Oh, I can't think of the word I'm looking for now. Jeez. Well, I have a thumbnail of a rainbow episode where Bungle is dressed as Superman, so 
I don't know, had uh, George and, well, it started anyway, George and Zippy building a war. Oh, and also... The Trump episode. <laughs> <laughs> An idea for next time, Hector's house? I don't think we've done a Hector's house, have we? We haven't. I've got a toy, Hector. My childhood toy, I've still got it, Hector. Are you so up for doing Hector's, Hector's house, house, another puppet show? Hexter's house, hex. I can't even say it. Hexter's. What is Hexter's? What is the hexing? Because <laughs> that that might not be. That might be a nice just uh, palate cleanser. Because oh, so. <laughs> uh, so. that's uh, horrible to do two evil puppet shows in one night. Is uh, oh, that's not good, is it? Not helping me. I've I've now got Jeffrey building a wall, and the the things that he says. What are you doing, Jeffrey? I'm building a wall to keep the Mexicans out, Zippy. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you building it in Colorado, Jeffrey? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if Jeffrey you... looks a little bit like Richard Maidley. I've never noticed before. Evil, like a grey-haired Richard Maidley. This woman's coming up. Why are you building a wall, Jeffrey? I'm keeping you out, you bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you know what you did. <clears throat> you know what you did to Zippy. <laughs> do they have neighbours in Rainbow? Do they? Well, she, Jeffrey has. Hmm. What do you think she thinks of a man living with a bear? Jeffrey, and... why is the wall I'm sat on made of cardboard, but the one you're making got real bricks in it? <laughs> <laughs> because you're just in my head, Zippy. <laughs> and I'm not even here. <laughs> That's even strange. <laughs> <laughs> and my neighbour is actually my doctor. Yeah. Still talking to them, Mr. <laughs> Mr. Hayes? Oh, yes. They're <laughs> all here. Shut up, Bungle. <laughs> <laughs> Right, so oh, hopefully geez. Hector's house will be nice and fun and friendly and not awful. Trust, I hope so, after that. Uh, so uh, we'll hopefully do that if we remember next time. And uh, in the meantime, if you have any nightmarish visions from your past that you would like to share with us that we haven't already done, let us know at Spread the Whimsy on Twitter. That's the best one. It is the best one, but you can contact us on facebook.com forward slash where the words were bigger and also via the website. We've got a website. Have you got a website? Doubt it. We've got one. Well... That makes me better than Badger. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm going to go and uh, something, something, love profit. I can't remember what it was. <laughs> work. Working the love profit. I'm going to go and work, work the love profit. Uh, so <laughs> we'll see you next time. Mm. He's going to touch his willy. Frictiony. <laughs> <laughs>